A Spokane dentist is hoping to take a bite out of crime by donating a bulletproof vest to a local police dog. KXY 4's Jeff Humphrey joins us live now from the Public Safety Building with a closer look at the role canines play in protecting our community. Jeff? Well, you know, Dave, ballistic vests are very expensive, and the Spokane Police Department doesn't have a lot of extra money lying around to buy its dogs additional protection. Fortunately, now two Eagle Scouts and a Spokane dentist have stepped forward to make up the difference. Silver handgun, possibly a 45, displayed by the subject. Spokane police are searching for a known gang member suspected of trying to run over two teenagers with this SUV. Hard to look like he reached for a handgun. Leading the charge is Strider, a three-year-old German Shepherd who doesn't know and doesn't care the suspect may be armed. He's part of canine unit. Make yourself known. Release my dog, he will find you and he will bite you. The prospect of nursing a dog bite behind bars flushes Brent MacGyver out into the open. But other Washington canines haven't been so lucky. We heard a shot out back there and then we heard a dog bark and then it was quiet. Last month, a Vancouver police dog had been on the job less than a week when this drunken suspect shot and killed him with a pistol. And that's why Strider's Spokane handler is now happy to have his partner wearing this new ballistic vest, compliments of Spokane dentist Cindy Thiel. I think the short answer is that we're dog lovers. And the longer answer is that we really appreciate these officers putting their lives on the line to protect us every day. Thiel's $1,800 donation comes as welcome news to Officer Sean Kendall. Sure, his beloved dog is safer, but so is Kendall now that his four-legged backup can stay in the fight longer. Absolutely, absolutely. You know, and, and uh, I'm a team leader in the SWAT team, and Strider's out there doing SWAT operations with me all the time. So even more dangerous situations, um, it's very important to get Strider some protection as well. And even if you are not a dog person, this new donated vest is saving you money. You know it takes about $10,000 to train up each canine, and so this new equipment just protecting your investment in the future. Reporting live at the Public Safety Building, Jeff Humphrey, KXLY4.